Indian Space Research Organization on Tuesday said that in its first ever in situ measurement carried out in the lunar polar region in through the laser induced breakdown spectroscope instrument that is on board Chandrayaan 3 rover Pragyan has confirmed the presence of the sulfur on the south pole of the moon now what is important here to understand is the laser induced breakdown spectroscope well this is that scientific technique that analyzes the composition of the materials by exposing them to the laser pulses so basically the intense laser pulses uh, focuses on the surface of the materials and then generates the uh, heat and also uh, the localized plasma too so through this scientific technique itself that the indian space research organization was able to confirm the presence of the sulfur indian space research organization in its statement has also said that along with the sulfur the rover pragyan has also confirmed the presence of the other elements like the aluminium the iron and calcium and other elements too so now what the uh, the isro is saying is that now further the hunt is on for the presence of the hydrogen so yes that is another important step that the isro is looking forward to remember on august 23rd is when the india scripted the history by achieving the soft landing of the chandrayaan 3 on the uh, south pole of the moon and later point just after couple of hours of achieving the soft landing right after the dust was completely settled down that's when the rover pragyan rammed out of the lander and for uh, even there also it went for a, a sleep a sleeping time for some more time and then it started with its uh, uh, scientific experiments and since then till now it is continuously giving isro one or the other important elements to uh, study and also all the data and information has been passed uh, here uh, at the command uh, center uh, in the bengaluru uh, where the isro team is looking forward to other crucial uh, a discovery as well with uh, related to the uh, the chandrayaan 3's whole mission as well so needs to be seen what all uh, you know secrets will be discovered by the rover pragyan in the coming days because remember this whole uh, the mission will be carried out for one lunar day that is 14 days of the earth so more and more information will be provided back to the uh, isro and remember on 26th is when that we first got to see the visual of the rover ramping out of the uh, land so that was the, the the video that was put out by the indian space research organization itself and then just after a couple of days again the isro gave that uh, status as well that how the rover came across the crater and it was able to retrace its path and head towards its uh, next step of uh, exploring the moon as well so this is very important because in the coming days the rover will continue to do its work in fact the payloads that are on the rover will continue to do its work and keep sending the crucial important data back to uh, isro which will actually help india because remember but this was the dream of the isro as well as the india to some day have the soft landing on the south pole of the moon and now it has come true